Hello there and welcome back to Old World Blues, my friends, in our current campaign, playing as Diana. As, of course, the Twin Mothers last time, we somehow took out Lanius's cohort, or his legion, his part of the legion, which someone in the last video's comment section said that he has a theory about why that happened, but right now, we've got quite a few comments to go through, as well as go to war with these dudes, the Sundogs. So let's go ahead and do that. They have trouble unification, and hopefully they begin attacking our lines like crazy. If not, I will... Oh, hello. I will call down the robots and just help push through the enemy's lands. It looks like we'll probably call down the robots, though. So let's go and do that, then. So, I asked you guys yesterday whether we should do, actually, the Protecting Colorado, or Goddess of War, or Goddess the Realms of Colorado, whatever this is. The Realm of Goddess, or Protecting Colorado. Now, there's support for, support for both sides. And if I choose one, that means I have to choose the other one in the future. So... Of course, then again, this only happens if you actually win. If you lose, then you can't do that. But regardless, if you do this again, the, for this campaign, though, it was selected that we shall do the Realm of the Goddess. Just because it, we've won, it might be a little bit more warfare-focused, so that would be kind of fun. The Realm of Diana. Of course, this one does require the Realm of the Goddess, so we'll go down with the Realm of the Goddess. It was recommended that I go down the agricultural part of our focus tree as fast as possible because we will start coring a lot of things much more quickly. Uh, the repository is actually very, very important for us. Uh, memory management will be good as well. Uh, let's see. Paintbrush, of course. Yeah, we want to get this stuff as done as fast as possible. So we should focus on gene crops, automated harvesting, industrial fertilizer, all that good stuff. And collecting specimen, which was another comment saying that we needed to re collect DNA so then we can analyze it. And then that will give us buffs and stuff like that. So that's really good. Apparently the mole rat one is potentially bugged at the time of this recording. But we'll see what happens. Let's go ahead. We could do the agricultural stuff, but really, we need to research stuff. And we just did Moonlight School so we can get some decisions going. Oh, memory management. More com computational power, but more power there. Memories of the Earth. Oh, we can't do a lot of this stuff yet just because we don't have the technology research yet. So let's do powering production. Little by little, the factory comes out of its slumber. Auxiliary generators, generators can come back online and manufacturing lines roar to life once again. It'll take a lot of time. A lot more than what is currently powered to truly take advantage of this pre-war automated wonder, and we should study possible solutions to this post-haste. Yes. So, we got to research through a lot of stuff very quickly, and actually probably do gene crops. That's probably the one we have to do first. Are you guys on the line yet? They're getting closer. We're going to the wasteland. The reservation was annexed. Goodbye, reservation. And we currently do, or can level up, twin mothers. Thank you. Level 7, not bad. Ooh. Go and build some more military fac civilian factories there first. We got quite a bit of political power as well, which is kind of nice. Oh, they're actually attacking us. Oh, I did not realize that they were actually were. Cool, funded militias. We will have to risk conscription level eventually. But I would like to core more territory. Ooh, what is that? Defenders of Peace. Oh, yeah, we have that for a while. Vacuum tubes. Can we do gene crops yet? Crop rotation, irrigation, and just fertilizer. Holy cow, getting gene crops takes quite a while. So what about automated harvesting or industrial fertilizer? Actually, I think, yeah. Crop rotation, irrigation, industrial fertilizer. Uh, we got to max this out, so crop rotation. It even tells us it unlocks grain sol solitation, sol solicities. What is that? Cool. It'll unlock. Oh, this one. So. Hel Helia falls ill, so be it. Invest in the past. That might not be bad. How much money do we have? Oh, they're still attacking us, so I love that. We got plenty of money. War games? Well, we gotta continue going down our land auction anyways, because that's just important to do. Get more def we actually get less defense for robots, more soft attack though, and breakthrough and heart attack, which is pretty good. Business favorites, ways, mobilize people, consumer goods, more stability. Why not? Stability for the people. And help all these guys here too. Ooh, unit training science. Ooh. We get guerrilla tactics un unlocked. Oh, that's kinda cool. I still want to do all this stuff, but we got some time to do that. Chop shop, looking pretty good. Invest stimulus in the past, which will be very nice. I'm surprised they're actually attacking us this harshly. Hmm. That's good for us. We're still mobilizing too, which is also very, very bueno. Power and production, and then we'll might be go memory management. Cool. New casings, of course. Contact lost. If you want to read that, go right ahead. When the leader fails, others pay the price, which is not good. You know, we'll probably do Realm of the Goddess next. So, to all that hear me, cherish my voice. For you have heard the call of your salvation. For centuries, you have lived in squalor and filth, adopting backwards practices that are the antithesis of a civilized life. 
I will bring the torch of knowledge and liberty to each and every one of you, as you all deserve better than your current affliction. You may not realize it yet, but I'm releasing you from a doomed cyclical existence, and in time, you will thank me for it. Peace and love becomes TTM conquers Colorado, more political power. Minus 60% justify war goals, and justify was war goals time, because right now we have a minus 50% justify war goals times red, so which actually increases the amount of time we need, but we get actually 10% bonus to it, I think, so that's good. Offensive war, penalty, stability modifier, nice. Less resistance target. Everyone in Colorado is going to hate us. Yeah, here it is. Peace and love. Oh, that's not good for us, but that's okay. Yeah, they're actually attacking us a lot more than I expected. A lot more. Wow. Do we actually have any planes? Ooh. Payload bombers. Those are okay. I'm, I'm considering not doing them. Because they, they go bye-bye too much. So let's go and just do that. There you go. Soft occupation. Oh, yes. I love soft, soft occupations. Ooh, that's so good. I gotta keep one guy on here too. I just have to. I just have to. Enforcer's max speed? Huh. We can't do this because we don't have additional... Oh, we need additional planning. Oh my goodness, this stuff is just too good to pass up. I, I gotta do trouble. Pro I gotta keep one on here too. And we already are doing crop rotation, but oh my goodness. Oh, it's so good. So good. What is that? Ooh, Moonlight Schools. We need to better educate our people. By going out and building schools, we can ensure that our people are well-educated. Plus 5% recruitable population. Cool. Can we actually do that everywhere, literally? Is that just in the capital? Uh, I guess we can invest in the pass if we really wanted to, of course. They are level 4, which is okay. Over here, we should probably still be increasing our area, right? I mean, that'll be good to do as well. So much... Oh, hold on. Hold on. We got the schools over here, too? Nice. Nice. Oh, it's all over the place now. Yes. Just going to do it all. Schools everywhere. So much more population. Awesome. And we can't probably do it in territory that is not cored. So, we got to keep doing some of this stuff too. Just because it's good for the robots. Support equipment. Do we have any stuff like that? Specialized doctrines, land doctrines, air stuff. Yeah, we're already having planes. There's so much we have to research. But there's just never enough time. Oh, wow, you guys have been really killing yourselves on the line. Thank you so much. Now help them out. Dust in the wind. Oh, that's not good. So it goes. That's not very good for scavengers. Oh boy, that's not ideal. Oh, they actually are abandoning the lines because they know we want to attack them up there. If that's the case, no, I want you in there. Go in there. There you go. Oh, we can circle them anyways. That's fine. Just let, let everyone attack, actually. That'll be fine. You guys force the attack. We killed off like six divisions here. That's pretty good. Organizations request increased production capabilities. Or capacity. The various economical powers established in our trade hubs have submitted to a request to increase our military production capabilities. If we are to fulfill those increased, increased, increased quotas, our economist estimates 23 military factories will be required. If these demands are fulfilled, they will promise us increased trading traffic and as well as some under the table rewards for being so kind. Ooh, hell yeah. Expert Hills Fighter, yes, absolutely. H how many factories are we talking about? Like, because I don't mind making some more. Because we could honestly really use some more. But, how much are we really talking? Achievable goal 23? How many more do we need? So no manual prospectors. Uh, anything else? Unit training would be nice. There it is. Three. Three more. That's all we need. Okay, we can do that. Yeah, totally. Totally. I always click those buttons incorrectly. Yeah, we'll have more than enough then. Old world planning is gone. Good. Let's get through this focus so we can get justifying people faster because I want to take, take out the black... Canyon, if possible. Nice. Realm of the Goddess, my friends. Twin Mothers, very cool. And do have a cup of coffee here. Excuse me, a cup of coffee here to keep us nice and warm, but the Realm of Diana, our battle against the Legion, has hardened our tribe's resolve. Gone are the days of peace, love, and tranquility. The wasteland is a harsh place, and enemies to the Twin Mothers must be dismantled so that they can never hurt the tribe again. The tribe has to grow, evolve, if it hopes to thrive in the wasteland, and the monsters such as Lanius. Our victory has made us stronger. The attack on our life has made us... What was it? The attack on our life is... I forget. Oh, my God. I'm so sorry I brought that up. But our resolve has never been stronger. That's what I remember. My apologies. Oof. That's so bad of me. I should probably look at my quotes before I say anything. Oh, yeah. The attack on my life has left me permanently scarred and deformed, but my, my resolve has never been stronger. My apologies. I was not thinking when I said that. The Realm of Diana. Oh. Cool. The helpless and downtrodden are all around the wasteland being preyed upon by lowly raiders, despots, and murderers. Only Diana and her vision can truly save the waste from this unending cycle of death and misery. It is time that these degenerates know the goddess is coming for them and she does not forgive nor forget. Oh god. 
sounds very violent, and that's what we like about her. Keep forcing that attack. Force them to submit. Good. We have so much political power. I want to save some of this, though, for... Uh, technically, the past. That would be pretty good. Eh, go and do that. Why not? But I want to save some of this so that we can course up more quickly around here. And even though we can course up, I just want to... When we course up, I want to get that benefit of us just getting a lot of extra things. Uh, at this point, it's... Uh, just course up anyways, probably. Any energy or water? Nope. But sun dogs are gone. Thank you, sun dogs. And it's time for actually to just find other people. It might be best to go to war with the hang dogs now just to take them out. How many divisions they got? I don't think we have enough to take them out, actually. Ooh, how about the black sun? We'll go to war with them next. How about that? But unfortunately, I... We'll be right back. All right, everyone, sorry about that, but we have the Caravan Ambush, a trade caravan delivering goods between settlements near the pass has been brutally ambushed. Not only did the brigands hold up the Brahmin, they slaughtered everyone as well. Guards are apprehensive to company more caravans, and merchants do not want to lose any more goods. A pursuit may stay in their minds, but the blood is already dried. Nothing can be done now. We can at least try. Yeah, we're definitely going to at least try. I mean, we have 100% stability, 100% more support now. Uh, we basically just took out... Uh, these guys over here, the Sun Dogs. And we do need to core them, so I'm spending a lot of political power, though, trying to, well... It doesn't even matter if we do this or not. We should actually do Moonlight Schools for, like, these impassable terrain areas. I don't care. If I see them, I'm gonna get rid of them. Cool. Okay, there's just more popped up. Go right ahead, guys. I wonder how much more monthly population you can actually get from doing this. Holy cow. All across the nation. Will we, we will have a lot of schools. But we are justifying on the Black Sun, which should be done in about 50 days, which is not bad. And we've done the Realm of Diana. And we got more political power. Terror for Relief is gone. Cool. Black Canyon Raiders. Claims and war goal for them. Oh. Heka Hekats or Hekati's army. All core land of the Black Canyon. Oh, okay. It's owned by the Realm. We can go to war with Ouroboros. Realm of Opportunity. Navajo's not in a faction. Oh, gotta kill them off probably, maybe. War for the Cyphers. Navajo, my dominion. Every Colorado state is owned by a neutral country. Claimed by Rumble Diana. Interesting. Well, an embassy with with the Western Republic. Ooh. We end up with one sample of Wanamingo DNA. That sounds really cool. The NCR could be a very powerful ally in our quest to heal the waste. Shall they prove themselves to be calm and collected? We should take steps to establish diplomatic channels between our nations so that we may both benefit and possibly gain another precious friend in this lawless world. But let us see how far we can trust them. You cannot always trust people who appear to be nice. No, you cannot. I know this seems like a waste of it, it might be, but stonks! We aren't quite sure what an index fund is, or even if they exist, against advice from our esteemed Jeremy, advisor Jeremy. This investment has done great in growing the wealth of our nation. Bull or maybe bear? And now we're all political power, but we've almost done with getting all these things. We've got like one, two, three, four, five, maybe? That direction, since. I, uh, we have 88 people a month. We're going to be having a lot of bodies by the time we're done here. So, uh, Drastic measures, we don't need to see that. Interaction with the followers. Yeah, we could probably do that at one eventually. Unit training would be nice. Like I said earlier, but that's okay. We can almost get, we get more than two political power a day. God dang. Human commanders, you betcha. And we shall finish our land auction with Age of the Machine. We're about to get more breakthrough, soft attack, and hard attack. Now, it is my goal to get as many robots in the field as possible. Now, I, I enjoy, I really do enjoy infantry, but we are going down the path that, or the land auction that goes for robots. So, we're probably going to do that. Let's get some more output first, though. Local innovation. This this tree is great. I love this tree. This Fallout Tech Tribal Folder. I guess it's a folder, not a tree. I think it's just great. I love it. Go down there, which means this one's going to pop up. Just so we can get rid of that, even though it would be better to do this area. First, another caravan. Um, I thought we already did this, but we're going to pursue them, probably. Send our manual prospectors, that'd be good. Cool. That's so much manpower now. 71 people a month, not bad. And we should be able to go to war pretty darn soon. And we should do okay. They might have some anti-tank here. Maybe. Ah, oh, they do have some anti-tank. We scavengers found something good. And the ruins of an ancient factory or scavengers found pre-war goods. Time will tell whether it was worth the blood and sweat we paid for. Better in our hands than our enemies. Infantry tech. Nice. If we could use that, maybe. 
And let's save up some political power now. Just because we might need it against uh, that's some thick hangdogs. We are technically expanding the border we do have with them, so we gotta be careful. We got enough basic weaponry. We wanna... Yeah, we really need to build up some more military factories. Ooh, nice. Uh, this looks actually okay for now. Go. No. Black Canyon Raiders. Black Canyon may have started off with noble intentions, but it's only a matter of time before the whole house of cards inevitably crumbles down into bickering raider gangs that fight each other at the expense of innocence. For their own good, we must put down Black Canyon before they even harm one Wastelander. I want to do that, and then we'll go back and do the focuses that give us benefits if we core more territory. So, Black Sun, thank you. After them, I'm thinking Cypher Warband, Armadillo. Whoa. Helki the Ripper. That's a cool flag. I doubt you have a focus, a uh, unique focus tree. That's cool. Painted Rock. That's a unique flag as well. Hello. Dyed Blood. Bone in the Red. Business Booms. Cool. Because that is still technically part of Colorado. We could go to war with Northern Texas. That is Northern Texas. East New Mexico we do own. Hmm. Big Bend Country. This is not good that we're surrounded by so many different people. Oh, Central Colorado, West Colorado. Oh, what are you doing? Hmm. Ciphers. I'm thinking maybe just go to war with those guys. Get it over with. Hmm. Cypher Warband, why not? Only takes 80 days, right? 16 political power, not bad. We should be able to win, right? We should. They have one division per tile, almost. So... Especially if we have our planes in the air. We should do okay, right? Hopefully. Planes. Five planes, please. Some lightweight metals. Absolutely. Switch you to medium. There you go. Alright, we're looking okay. Oh, there it's... Oh, I forgot they could come down there. Oh, well, whatever. It's alright. Let the robots really push through. You know what? They fit you too. Why not? I really should stop doing this, but I kind of want to keep doing it. Irrigation, nice. Ooh, right there. Don't forget that. And industrial fertilizer. Good. Very good. Get these guys off. Nice. We're doing pretty darn well, I'd say. Even more manpower. Never enough. Never, ever enough. Good. Black Sun is ours. Logan's Fall, do we need that to capitulate them? Probably? Attacking us, they're out of supply. Of course, we're taking a little bit of attrition too, but that's okay. 2.15 every day, not bad. Do we have enough resources? No, we don't have enough robots. But what else is new? I'm waiting for the planning. Go ahead. Good enough for me. Ooh, another division? Don't mind if we do. Don't mind if we do again. Actually, we gotta edit these templates just because they're... They're not good enough, in my opinion, right now. Uh, you are two combat with, you are three. There you go. That's not bad. It's gonna ruin supplies, though. We'll make these guys 40 combat with eventually, probably. Mm, 12... Might as well do that for now. We're, we're going to have to really expand our facilities here. Most definitely. Logan Fall. Well, at least it's gone. And we go to war with the next group, too. Awesome. 71 factories. Not bad. Not bad. So let's set it up like this. I want my, well, robots to really focus on killing these guys off. And if they attack us constantly over a river, because we don't have, an, because we don't have a lot of divisions up here, sounds good to me. Cool. And then you guys go right here. Oh, you'd have a open a hole there. That's not good. And make it three. Good luck. That's a big old tile, then. Hopefully no one goes to war with us, but, you know, you never know. All right. We could do that stuff, but we're going to wait. We are going to go down this side some more, if possible. I thought we automated harvesting and crops here. Oh, industrial fertilizer. We could do this one. Bonus for automated... Well, crap. I should have realized that earlier. Bonus for automated warfare. Hmm. Power of the Atom? 
less stability? Yeah, why not? A simple solution would be to bring back online the integrated nuclear generators inside the factory, but to do so would be problematic to say the least. Should we really try to harness once again what was brought to humanity's end so many years ago? The benefits are enormous, but it would take considerable efforts, and the Twin Mother's try would be surely disapprove of this. But whatever. Powers need to be fulfilled. Yeah. Mm. Automated harvesting, gene crops, industrial fertilizer. Well, we're barely on that one right now, so... And right now, we could probably keep doing this. I don't know. I, I think it... We, I want to core some stuff first. Do we, we core everything up here? No, we have not. Hey, we actually got one more water. That's cool. And did it get a reduction in coring costs, so... Hey, we got a few more factory studios. Awesome! I hope this will be enough guys to help hold it up here. Maybe not. That's a cast. We can throw a few factories over here. The factories, I'll post. There you go. Pursuit. Our militia found the brigands, but we cannot stop their escape. Multiple members of our militia died in the, the assault. It seems like the sacrifice was in vain. Next time we'll be prepared. Oh, crap. That's not good. That's definitely not good. Ooh, establish an NCR embassy? We've heard many stories of the NCR from our time interacting with the Legion. Perhaps it's a good idea to send an expedition out west and see what they're all about. Twin Brothers and NCR begin a series of beneficial trades, exchanging volunteers, resources, and knowledge for the betterment of each other. We, as well as every member of the NCR, gain Twin Brothers and NCR Embassy. Agricultural research speed, daily compliance... Oh, no, not no compliance, but political power and weekly manpower. Oh, wait, hold on. I don't mind doing that, but I'm not joining your faction, son. You, you got another thing coming. You think I'm joining your faction? And New Vegas is trying to kill off the Mojave Territories. Well, let's see how that works out for you. Also... Apparently, someone said that actually to upgrade this stuff, you need money. Ruin factories. Let's go and go with rear interception, because we have enough money for now. So, while our scouts were savaging the ruins of some place, I can't read, because that's too yellow, we stumbled on something quite peculiar. Many people of the old rule knew this place for a singular, singular reason. A reason now known to us. Excavation took us days, but we finally uncovered it. One of the few batches of mozzarella cheese left untouched by the war. Not only have we earned earth and uncontaminated cheese, but we also found the secret Roswellian re recipe. For the new found cheese industry, not only will our armies have stronger bones, but also stronger hearts as well. Pizza's back on the menu. Ooh, look at that. Roswell cheese production. Is that... Okay. We get plus 1% more political power gain, and special forces minimum capacity plus 1. Um... Okay. Sure. Minimum prospectors? Sure. But, okay. Oh, we can get over with our armadillo already, huh? Well... You guys might be able to win. I don't know. I kind of hope they would be attacking me, but whatever. Could you guys actually win by yourselves? You might be able to. I kind of don't trust that they would be able to, but maybe they will? If I force the attack, will you win? I should probably really put some planes on these guys. Oh, wow. Some of these guys are getting... Holy... They do, they're doing... Do, they gotta be doing last stand. Look at their strength. Holy cow. Oh, come on. I can't do stuff there. Power of the wind. That'd be nice. Computational power. Electricity. Power of the earth. Construction. I do like construction quite a bit, so... Power of the earth. Geothermal energy. Tidal waves and underground generators. Energy is already there, just waiting to be harnessed. But first and foremost, we must study new ways to properly build said infrastructure without disturbing the ancient environment. Once done, the elements of the earth itself shall power the factory. Yeah, they're literally doing last stand or desperate defense, so that's awesome. That is awesome. We're just going to literally just kill off their guys. They chose it. We didn't choose it for them. Level 9, nice. That's not enough money. 110, that's not enough. Hey, there we go. Just fertilizer. I'm going to keep doing this just because we got a bonus ahead of time. And now we can do the other focuses and, focuses and stuff like that. Look, innovations. Awesome. Terrain penalty reduction. I love that. Soft attack. Yes. Oh, my goodness. Now, normally, and I believe including this campaign, too, I normally do not want to always get rid of all of my infantry, Be especially because I really am pushing for robots. That is because sometimes robots do make mistakes or there's going to be problems with using them. So, there's o it's always good to keep a thing as... Spare. Spare infantry, just in case. Especially when we have <laughs> robot deficits, so. Oof! Hmm. 
Hmm. Yeah, so many more military factories. Pursuit! Next time we'll be prepared. God dang it. Not again. Well, we need to get more stability. That'll be alright. Okay. Okay, you convinced me. Okay. And then right there, too. Boom. Boom. I know I should not be doing that as much, but we get, we're get we getting so much political power in the end, it won't matter. Radio interception. Spend some more money. Cool. Hey, Cyber War Band. Thank you for playing. I hope we're not going to be pissing people off in Texas. Too much. Actually, there's a little faction. It's like the Native American or Great Plains Federation over here. Painted Rock. Well, if you're in my way, how much would we need? Three more. Oh, that's not bad. Three more for 60 days. God dang. I love it. Okay, yeah. Why not? Infantry is doing a great job so far. Well, as great as it can be right now. Alright, enough army XP. I'm just going to go convert you all to basically Amazons, because you're all basically the same thing. Thank you, daughters. Thank you very much. Y'all have... Oh, chems and recon. Throw in some not-doggos demos. And anti-tank. We should have enough anti-tank for this. Yeah, we do. There you go. Just in case. Makes you nice and stronger. Out of confederation. Have everyone train, because you'll probably need to. I really want to go to war with these guys. I really do. Will they be able to pierce me? Yes. Well. Hmm. Crud. How are you not getting your infrastructure? Build, 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 build. Even if you can't access areas. I don't really care. Just build. I should really core more territory. Cool. Because all this will be cored ter territory eventually. Power of the earth. Boom, 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 boom. Cool. Let's do Exponential Humidity Amplifier System. The EHAS. Terraforming package was integrated into the creation kit to help desert-like ecosystem recover from radiation waves. Its activation can be done with some efforts by using our waste on soil study and the infrastructure used to amplify humidity made to render, render permanent. Able to be scrapped once its purposes have been served. Nice. So I'm not going to core territory until we get at least that one done. Boom, boom. Done. Done once again. Awesome. Radio interception group. Next one. I don't care what the cost is, because we have hopefully enough. Oh, this is expansion. Ooh. Establish, put your, put your beat. Eh, who cares? We'll do it anyways. We have enough money for now. Yes. Yes, 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 yes. A thousand times yes. Yeah, we're going to call in a few divisions to help out over here. Hmm. Y'all might want at least one hanger, let's say. Make two for now. Put you on medium. Good god, we need so many more robots. Oof. Invest stimulus into the past. Yeah, we could do that. Unit training? Oh, we need more army XP. Well, maybe we should stop spending so much then. That's a case. Screw it. Come right here. But actually, all of you, go right here. There you go. We're going to go to war next. I don't want to wait. <clears throat> I really don't. Cool. And then build up one right there. Ah, eh, build two. Why not? There we go. Unit training. Do we get more daily army XP? That's good. That's good stuff. I'm going to get paid soon. Awesome. Hey! I made harvesting. Great. Screw it. We're going to do gene crops too. Beautiful. Yum, 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 yum. And we're almost done with that one too. So, overall blues, that sucks. We found nothing. Oh, oh come on. We can go to war with them now. Uh, you know, I'm going to use infantry against those guys. You guys come down here. I don't trust the robots too much. Just enough, though. Let's see. One, two, four. You guys go here. You'll be able to defend well enough as long as you can get entrenched, probably. Four. Eight divisions should be able to hold out. And then I'll use these guys. I'll use the robots to push through. So, you guys are done. Scrapper's compact, huh? Wow. 
Over two pinnacle power days is great. Even though it's not, it hasn't beat my record yet of getting like three a day, I think at one point with, I'm going to play as a Royal. A Royal is fun. Heart attack, recovery rate. Yeah, let's grab some more IED training. <laughs> Sounds awesome. All right, stop training. Y'all are pretty good enough. Give some radar. Three, two. This might be a mistake, but we'll do it anyways. Oh, wait, hold on. Glowbug. Who the heck is Glowbug? Oh, they're right there. They can't even touch us anyways. Little by patches. Who is that? Female or male? New audience. Oh, it's a dude. Okay, never mind. The penitentiary. What happened to the old Colorado? I know they're immediately going to attack us. And glow bugs are fighting us. Those buggy little guys. Thank you. Boom, boom, boom. There you go. Plenty of planes, you should be able to hold out. And I'm not, hopefully you won't have to worry about that at all. So, let's come over here again and do Geologic Crystal Growth Prism. Applying our existing research into automated gathering systems could reactivate the GCPP's subroutine pertaining to the creation of mineral deposits for resource star territories. While the activation would be random, it would still create additional deposits for us to mine and increase our output for alloy and consequences. Cool. Yeah, this is actually going to get him a lot of experience, which is nice. Hell's Fighter, Desert desert Fox. Oh, yeah, look at that. Beautiful. And we have so much political power every day. I love it. All right, level 10. For some reason, I thought they said before that you can't get to level 9 or 10 without doing, like, focuses or something. But we just, we just develop ourselves as much as possible, and we do okay. Beautiful. Look at all that damage. Oh, and they are shooting us down a little bit, but whatever. Don't really care. As long as we win, that's all that matters. Let's see. New Citizens Care Package. That might not be bad. We could do that, maybe. I'll help settlements. Absolutely. Actually, anything else down here? Nope. Unit training that saves the Army XP. Also take over Petro Chico. You know what? New Citizens Care Package. Less resistance, more compliance gain. No problem. Let's see. Enemy operative stuff. Infiltration rack. Ooh, he's got a Gecko Pack. Let's go with Ard Ardneh. Version 15. I love not having to worry about too much here. Anything else? Not too much? Oh, wait, we need to go to war, right? Oh, Painted Rock. Yeah. Oh, oh, actually, you... Can you guys, can you guys really win? I don't know if they, these guys could actually win. This is what we probably will call a gamble. Give them a few days. We gotta go to war by March 25th. We got a little bit of time. Cool. Let's get. I'm gonna deploy you guys right here immediately, just in case. Are we missing something? Oh yeah, anti tank of course. And you'll be loved by someone, such as Multivac. Hello, Multivac. Welcome aboard again. Some organization monoplane fighters. Engine advancements might as well at this point. Oh, 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 we actually lost the territory there. Well, crap. Maybe we should pay attention up here a little bit more. Good luck. Don't worry about it. Go and do that. It's probably a really bad idea doing this. But they say they can win. I probably shouldn't trust them. Oh, we attack each other. A whole bunch. Oh, now you say you can't win. I see how it is. Guerrilla Tactics. Cool. Uh, let's see. Diana. Compound bow. It seems like we should probably go that way. Explosive bow. You know, I think we're going to go down this way just because this is unique. This is more unique than compared to the laser weaponry right now. So, Well, we're winning on defense and kind of winning on offense. Good luck, guys. You're going to need it. Infantry. Good luck, guys. You're still going to need more of that. How many men have we lost? Eh, that's not that bad. Painted Rocks only lost a thousand. Not bad, not bad. Push them in. Now, don't lose down here. Or over here, I should really say. Cool. Oh, crud. That's a case. I will deploy you guys early. Boom. Hey, you guys go right there. Just in case. Cool. 
And we gotta wait for that. New casings. I wanna get more computational power. So... Oh, we need to research so much to get there first. Oh, let's grab this one. The discovery of numerous century bot models around the nursery tasked, tasked with security and research into their inner workings has given us an opportunity to study the combat databanks as well as salvage them. High grade parts will be put to good use in Diana's mainframes. Absolutely. That's the only other division here. Cool. Good luck, guys. Hey, we got Painted Rock. Oof, that was definitely a gamble. You can go back there. Boom, boom. Alright. Yeah, oh my goodness, this is not good. This is more of a gamble up here. Get in there, get in there. How many men have we lost? 200? Oh, versus 3,000 is not bad. Yeah, at this point we're going to start getting in there and just, you know, messing their stuff up. Eh, nerd rage. Meh, it's kind of okay. Not really what I'm shooting for right now, but that's alright. Hey, new Reno, cool. Gene crops, very awesome. These guys are going to attack down that way, that'd be great. Because we already know what we have to do, I'm going to go for steam powered extraction for the, one of the focuses that require it. Send up men of prospectors because we can. Oh, don't want to forget this. Wait, science? Wait, we can't do science? There was a science thing here earlier. Followers, research speed. Um, okay, well, it's gone now. Alright, well, whatever. We were designs, that stuff is okay. We could raise a conscription, but I think we're doing okay. Let's get Flyboy. Oh, we're still mobilizing. Oh, nice. Oh, our guys are showing up. Well, I mean, some of the guys are already here, so. Oh, you're level 6. Oh, yeah, look at that. Expert health fighter. Yes, don't mind what we do. Hurry up up there. We can go to war with a stretch. But I'd rather kill these guys off right now, then. How much more manpower do you guys have? None! Oh, this will be good. This will be great. Stockpile? Not much. Got some infantry equipment and some special forces, but other than that, y'all kind of toast. And you're like, burn toast. You ain't that tasty. Unless you like burn toast. That's kind of weird. Eh, we can invest stimulus, but we'll see what happens. Anything else here? Naval stuff? Not really interested in naval stuff. Aircraft companies? We don't really have close air support, though. Let's try about the next focus. Refractoring radiation compression device. Our knowledge of genetic engineering allows us to, with some effort, reactivate the RRCD subroutine for the creation kit. A powerful uh, genetic scanner automatically tracks corrupted DNA strands in fauna and flora, then purges said corruption and restores original sequences. Its algorithm is extremely powerful, and we can put it to good use. We also need to research. Ra we have yet to do radio. What is wrong with me? Oh crap! Look at these guys. Um, emergency transfer over here. Oh, you got, well, I mean, a single division I'm not going to be able to do well right there. Just in case, send half you guys over here, too. That might spark more interest in them attacking us with that. Actually, yeah, might as well. Legions, having a good time. Get back in there, please. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Come again, come again. Yeah, they think they can win. And they, there's a patent, there's a possibility that they could potentially win. But no. Yeah, come back over here. I can't believe I did not do any of this yet. My apologies. Oh my goodness. What is wrong with me? Oh. It's good you guys are coming back over here too. Yeah, I, I don't want to be foolish and tech over a river. Man, you guys took a while though. Oof. Any other pieces of territory we can put more monthly population on? No. Okay then. Alright, guys, finally slowly showing up. We got IEDs. Don't mind if we do. Recovery rate, organization. I'm going to go ahead and just grab some radio now. That'd be good. Half a chocolate bar's rations. Ooh, wow, minus 25% supply consumption. Holy crud. That seems pretty nice. Uh, that being said, what else do we have down here? Let's see. Ooh, Uncord States, of course. Trade node map. Twin Mothers, New Canaan. Trade route established. 2993 Lone Star. Nah. The route's already in use. These guys. 
194. Holy cow. Recall trade route? Nah. Oh, Twin Brothers New Canaan? Oh, I think we're already using it pretty much all of ours already. Oh, yeah. Nice. Uh, what else do we do with political power then? Ooh, there we go. There we go. We're, now we're done with this side. Nice. Power of the wind. Which one? Uh, control more than nine states. Yeah, let's get the reduction in coring costs. So, further study into the wind based power options could not only give a natural advantage or alternative to the many industrial genera generators barely keeping the factory on, but also make it much easier to design aerial designs for more multiple aerodynamic studies. Shall we try to harness the power of the wind? I'd probably say so, yeah. If we can use it, then we could probably abuse it. And that always sounds like fun. Well, hmm. Uh, do we have enough big enough airport here? Maybe not. There you go. There you go, too. Beautiful. Now it's going to be kind of costly doing this. But I think we'll be okay. I want you guys to break all the way up to there. Can you do that? Can you falsely attack, crush all these humans underneath them, or underneath the robots, and have a good time? Well, we might just be able to. That's going to be costly. But that's why I'm not attacking, and you guys are. Oh, can't do that. Oh, boy. Can't do that either. How about some better refined mixtures? How about that? Refined mixtures for everyone to have. Old old blues, that kind of sucks, but whatever. Hey, you did it. Get a little closer. They're still attacking us. Fine with me. Don't really care. Force attack. Just keep forcing it. They can't. They don't have enough manpower, so. Force them into submission. Good. We've, this is actually pretty costly, but it's pretty necessary. Oh, there goes Utah. Someone also recommended I should play as a Sorrow sometime. And I'm like, okay. Sometime? Uh, with the update out, I, I probably not going to for a while. But, you know, we'll see what happens. 2.49? Not enough. If that's the case, get more research speed. Support equipment? Why not? We, can lose. we could allow ghouls and those people in. Fairy Captain, you might as well at this point. Wind power? Not bad. After that, though. Memory management? More computational power. A Rising waters? A Steam powered extraction? Why not? So the power of steam might be the answer to a problem. By harnessing the tides of the Rio Grande River and using steam generators placed along the coast, we could further power the factory while still having only minimal disruptions in the local fauna. More computational power and 8% reduction in coring costs? At this point, Diana seems like the very good, you know, person or, you know, leader to basically core the entire wasteland. Like, for real. Yeah, that seems really awesome. Ooh, we do, oh, it's probably good to get bricks. It's probably really, really good. Land auction, of course, is done. Specialized auction. Oh, that would be cool if we could do that one, too. But that's okay. What else do we need to do? Robots. Robots. Don't forget robots. We need to get Mr. Handy's as well. Ooh, more speed. Breakthrough. I want to get more breakthrough first. Go, my robots. Crush them. Yeah, they're definitely getting hurt. Everyone's getting hurt. But you know that's called life. Oh man, we gotta keep an eye on our energy cell usage too. We probably want to research some of that good stuff too. Or or just make it. There we go. Do you not have infrastructure here? Oh, you don't have... Oh my goodness. That is terrible. Absolutely terrible. Could you guys attack and win? Probably not. But you know what? It keeps them in place. So that's what matters. You six. Come up here. I want you to... Hurt them. Hurt them badly. Make them that they wish they were never born. And even though we may take a lot of losses, we're actually starting to break over the river. Holy cow. And supplies are very bad around here. Whatever. Good. Break over that river. They've only killed off 10,000 of them. That's not enough. Never enough. Fall of Heavens get cool. You guys can't win over there, but that's fine. Whatever. Good luck. I actually might. You might still. If you want to hold out, you've got the right to. You're just going to lose your life. That's all. 31 damage is not enough. 
Mall. Investments falling through. We recently had a woman in here who pitched a great idea. Attach small boxes to mole rats to deliver messages around the wayside. It was a genius. No more couriers and mole rats working for scraps. The one issue we did not anticipate, however, was that mole rats don't enjoy boxes attached to them. Too bad we already bankrolled Miss N. Price. Cut our losses. We can't afford this. Ask Jeremy for a small loan. We rolling in the money. What you talking about? Let's grab some more complicated circuitry for even faster research speed. Never enough. Ooh, maintenance companies actually would be probably pretty good to throw on our robots, actually. Yeah, let's have you get some maintenance companies. Force it. Force it. Kill them off. Kill them off. Come on. Get rid of these guys up here. We broke over the river, too, which is awesome. Yes. 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 A thousand times yes. Just don't get in a circle. For the love of God, please don't get in a circle. Cool. Rising waters. Natural power generation. The wind is a natural resource easily harnessed to produce energy, but it is inefficient. And as such, we would need to gain considerable territory to be able to have a decent yield. Once it would be settled, we could construct massive, frictionless wind farms to power the factory and bring its back its mighty industrial capacity to life. Cool. Anything else? Oh, look at this. Development project La Garita, La Garita Caldera WTT. Less manpower, we use civilian factories, more manpower. Oh, let's see what happens. Anything up here? Anything down here? No? Okay. Well, 81, not bad. Because I do want to start coring other places too, so. 86. Yeah, let's core that area too. Well, once we get there. 90 factories, not bad, not bad. Primitive radio, not bad. Grab some radio now. Regular radio. I know I shouldn't be attacking like this, but that's okay. They will die soon enough. Wow, look at that naval XP. I didn't know we could go above 500. I did not realize that. Okay, anointed. Okay, bye-bye, anointed. Uh, I'm sure we're doing tremendous on resources. Just absolutely tremendous. Come on, guys. You've got to give up. You can't be mobilizing, right? Cutting to the slave trade. They're completely out of manpower. We've killed off like 20-ish, roughly 20-ish divisions. So, there we go. Here we go. You see this division? You make him go bye-bye. Look at how weak they are. Look how weak. You just can't keep this up. I swear, man. You just can't. Good job, guys. If that's the case, I'm going to do this. You guys are actually going to come over here. And you're going to spread out, not like cancer, but like a, a growth. And by growth, I mean like a plant. Slowly spread out and make yourself beautiful little butterflies. Go, go, go. And this will help reduce uh, supply issues, hopefully. Hopefully. No, you, you go here and you just kill them off. You go, yeah, you're already doing that, so it doesn't matter. I might get logistic companies for our robots. Hey, we got the penitentiary. Saratoga, huh? Oh, we get the glow bug too. Now, that's going to be a problem since we're going to continue expanding our board with these guys. If that's the case, I'm going to actually really invest more into my army then. We're going to need a lot more divisions where we're going. Hey, Assassin City. That sounds awesome. Holy cow. What the heck happened in Texas? Santa Ana. Wow, that is so sad. Power needs fulfilled? The power needs for the factory terraforming needs have been more than fulfilled. We can now produce so many tools, seeds, and devices that we can take some of the supply chain for more precise usage. Gains one gecko we can use to improve our lands. Sounds like a good idea. Anything else around here? No? Bitter drink, huh? Mystery caves? Mm, okay, sure, why not? Just deep within the earth, the factory fully awakes, roaring back to life as its manufacturing lines and automated systems come back online. Its terrain and vertebrates once again move through the nursery, providing sample seeds and parts to all corners of paradise. We can now use its capabilities to manufacture a fully functional GEC. Just one, though? Just one? Simulation training. Oh, yeah. Definitely have to get down there. Nice. 
84. That's a bit much, I'd have to say, but that's alright. Yeah, the robots are definitely struggling now. There you go. Pass. Might as well, right? How does that affect our money, though? Oh, oof. Yeah, we're starting to run out of energy, which is not good. Come on, guys. You're being pathetic. This is why I don't like using robots, because they can eventually just pierce you, and it sucks. It really does. Alright, you all come here right now and kill them off. Maintenance companies. We've got some maintenance, too. Defense cooling systems. Give Mr. Handy, because he can... We need him. Oh, we actually need some circuitry now. Oh, that's not good. Yeah, no, you've got a... You've got a, a vamoose over there now. The robots are dying for your cause, even though like, technically I don't think they would actually die. Oh, crap, we're out of energy. Because we're using so much... Actually, we only have four. Oh, crap. Hang dogs. I don't care how much we need. Just get whatever you can get. Come on, break over the god dang river. Wait, how do you get strength? Hold on, they get strength back. They must have mobilized. They must have. They have only five factories, though. Come on, man. We broke over. This is why I still keep infantry no matter what. No matter what. Nice. Uh, does Ruth have an upgrade? How do you not have an upgrade yet? Desert Fox. Desert Fox Hills Fighter. Desert Fox as well. Oh, we cut these guys off. They should die instantly, basically. If that's the case, we're going to go back to these guys and start justifying on them. Nice. Only 2.5 political power a day. This guy just found something cool. Power needs fulfilled. Memory management, more computational power, memories of the traveler. This seems kind of fun. I kind of want to do this one. Memory management. As Diana's computational power has increased, she has been able to rearrange and orga organize her memory more efficiently as time went on. However, recently something has happened. Something strange. It seems like hidden or corrupted records might keep appearing as she digs deeper. With time and care, she might yet be able to recover her history. Oh, yes. So, let's see. I want to finish this war off now. So we have the Gek? Yes. So I want your opinion. Where should we deploy the Gek? Wherever we see this. I'm, I'm not going to see every single one of these places. But I'm not sure where we should deploy the Gek. If you have an opinion, please put it in the comments below. I'm not going to check out what these places are, but from what the n names that you read here. What place should we put the Gek in? Or use the Gek on? Spearman? Kind of interesting, I'd say. Kill them off. Go kill. They're dead. We've only killed off 16,000, so. Not nearly like it's been a lot. And I'm going to go ahead and position you guys somewhere so you don't lose all your strength. That'd be good. Goodbye. And if you'd be so kind as to actually take out the enemy, that'd be great. Cool. What do you, what do you mean you don't have orders? Don't give me that. There you go, see? I told you you have orders. I don't want to expand stuff up there. Wow, this is kind of scary. Oh boy, they already broke over to us. That's not good. And I guess I'll position you next to Lubbock, maybe? But regardless, hope you enjoyed today's episode. If you did, consider leaving a like. Subscribe if you're new. Check out my Discord link in the description below, and I'll see you tomorrow. When we will invade Texas, do more research, and have a good time overall. Thanks for watching. Have a great rest of your day.